everybody and welcome back to Black Dice Gaming. Uh, today we're going to be looking at some Shield Wolf miniatures. This is the uh, Shield Maidens. Uh, they make either infantry or the rangers. Some amazing box art there. Uh, there's enough parts to make 20 models in the 28mm scale. Uh, flip over, got some lovely illustrations. And then a full list of everything that is uh, contained within the box. So without further ado, let's look at the sprue. Uh, I think they're 25mm bases, just standard uh, round plastic bases. So on this one, we get two different types of sprue, although the majority of it is similar to one another. So there's, look at these lovely slender female bodies. Very barbarian-esque. Now you see these little squares here. I'll show you what they're for in just a second. Okay, and then we have some really, really impressive capes and some crossbows and quivers and whatnot. Now the way these attach is there's a connector just just there, and they attach directly into the back of the bodies. Now, if you don't want the capes, then that's what these four things are for, just here. Uh, so they correspond with the bodies, and you would just pop them in instead. So that would go into there instead of the uh, the cape. Okay, hope that makes sense. Uh, nice selection of shields. We've got five uh, different styles on this sprue. And we've got a couple of hooded heads there, and then we've got a couple of more bodies just here. Uh, we're also moving on to the arms as well on this, this part here. And then we've got a really big selection of heads. How many is that? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15 different heads. Uh, actually 16, 17 with the two hooded ones as well. Uh, so that's pretty much a, each model could pretty much have a different head. Sorry, I'm just glancing across at the command sprue that I'm going to show you in a second. There isn't a different head on that, but yeah, so each model could uh, pretty much have a different head if you wanted to. Let me see. Get a better view. Look at those lovely wavy locks. So if you're looking to mix up your models in, uh, in an Earthmark army or something along those lines, then you absolutely could. Now the second sprue is majority of the same, so we've got more of the same just here, and then similar shields. However, at the bottom part of this sprue, you get the uh, the banner, the horn, one hell of a sword. That's really impressive. I mean, look at the size of the blade compared to the arm. Very, uh, very nice. Uh, slightly different uh, cape to the rest. This one's got like a fair aspect to it. Uh, and a, an unusual sort of shaped shield here compared to the round ones. Uh, with a lovely detail just there. I've also got a selection of hand weapons on this sprue. Okay. So that, that's one hell of a nice sword as well. Didn't see that one. That's nice. And then you've got this sort of chain uh, with a ball at the end that obviously you can use that arm to attach. Some nice axes. Yeah, and there you go. So you get three sprues with the flag and two sprues without. All right, so that's six, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Yeah, so you get six bodies on this sprue and you get two of those. And you get four bodies on this sprue, and you get three of those, and that makes your 20 models. All right, so that about wraps it up. Uh, if there's anything else, then please drop me a message. Uh, james.blackdice at gmail.com. Uh, or send me a, a, a message in the comments down below. I do try and answer everything. Uh, pick up on all messages. Uh, as always, please like and subscribe, share with your friends, and uh, hopefully I shall catch you in the next one.